This is an electric DC motor. It spins very fast, about 24,000 times every minute, but it doesn't generate much torque. Torque is a rotating force. You apply force to a lever to generate torque and tighten a nut. You've felt torque if you've used the hand drill. On the lower torque settings, I can easily grab the chuck and stop it from spinning. On the higher settings, I can't. I can't apply enough force from my hand to overcome the additional torque. Power is torque times speed. It's how rapidly you can apply that torque. The motor transfers its power, torque and speed, to the wheels of the car. When I add weight, the motor has to generate more torque and it slows down to do so. When I add enough weight, the motor stalls. Power gets transferred through the gears. Gears are like dials that adjust the speed and torque that gets delivered to the wheels. When I hook the pinion gear to the larger gear now, the car moves. The larger gear generates more torque than the smaller gear. The power at each of these gears is the same, but the torque and speed change based off of their relative sizes. You need a lot of torque to move an object from rest. The trade-off is speed. The car in higher gear should eventually overtake the car in lower gear. Lower gear will get you off the line faster, but a higher gear will give you a higher top speed. I just didn't have a long enough track to show that. So then, what exactly is horsepower? Power tells us how fast we can move a load. You can move a light load really fast or a heavy load a little slower and put out the same power in both cases. Two vehicles can have the same engine horsepower but have completely different functions. One is built to carry and move heavy loads while the other is built for speed. An electric car might have the same function and even the same specs as a gas-powered car, but the electric car will easily outrace the gas-powered car because it hits its peak torque much faster. This is all a bit simplified, but as you can see, there are many factors to consider when choosing the right engine or motor for your application. So, in summary, torque is a rotating force. You need torque to move heavy loads. Horsepower is torque times speed. It tells you how fast you can move that load. Gears don't change your power. They trade off speed for torque or torque for speed. Horsepower is important, but it doesn't tell you everything. And you're probably still confused, but hopefully a little less so. Thanks for watching.